Hello, my name is Ian Rakoma. Uh, I'm a Las Vegas oil painter, and this is my show, First Gen. First Gen is in reference to being a first generation American, born first generation, um, which I have a lot of experience with because my parents were from the Philippines and they immigrated here, and I grew up here. Uh, I was born in New York and then moved to Vegas. And it's just the experiences that a lot of first generation people um, go through growing up. I try to capture some of those things, nothing too negative, uh, mostly positive or kind of like you know, in between. Just, I didn't want this to feel uh, like a pity party, which a lot of, I feel like a lot of shows about immigration goes through. It's more lighthearted. These are all people that I know in my life, and I know a lot of these, um, you know, it, it speaks to Asian Americans, Southeast Asian Americans. Touches on the idea that a lot of these kids, you know, they reached out to, you know, other people who um, were in the same, similar situations where their family came from somebody else, uh, somewhere else and they're trying to make it or just get along with people. Uh, in school or you know at the park so I wanted to include her because you know it wasn't just us obviously um, there were other people involved uh, this is a, a, a painting of a, a couple friends of mine you know this is a picture of them in Halloween dressed up as Game of Thrones characters I made this one particularly because I know this uh, that the show title is first gen but uh, this one's called Second Generation. So it, it speaks more about the, uh, the baby in the middle. Uh, and, you know, after the initial step of first generation, you know, the, it, they become almost completely assimilated by that point into American culture. Because uh, the disconnect between, you know, the motherland and here, you know, it almost disappears by that point. Uh, I want to say about third or fourth generation, it's completely gone. I believe uh, this one could be taken uh, multiple ways. Um, they're titled Cuz, short for cousins. Um, and it's just, in my experience growing up here, a lot of the children had that haircut, you know, were dressed a certain way, you know, just like a lot of second hat clothing. And um, just the things that they went through. And they typically hung out with each other and you know, it, it would be later on where they branched out to uh, other children. Yeah, I did want to play a little bit off of the stereotypes for sure um, and wanted to use them with the paintings as a kind of poking fun at it as well. You know, that's a, a, a big staple when we were children, spam and eggs, spam eggs and rice, you know, uh, classic breakfast. Uh, it usually makes you feel good when you smell it and then you eat it, you know, your day's gonna be fine. If you get that. This one particularly is actually a, a, a photo of me, uh, you know, on a, a birthday when I was younger and the dinner was you know, a roasted pig. So it's more of a realistic portrait. And then that dog is, that dog wasn't there. You know, that, that dog is my dog growing up. The um, car accident, uh, you know, because I don't know what your experience is with you know, Asian kids, but they were really big on their uh, rice burners, you know, like Honda Civics, Toyotas. Um, so I want to kind of show the, the uh, other side of that, you know, the consequences of messing around too much. And also with these ones, the smaller ones, I wanted to show that, you know, those kids, you know, they might look really nice and friendly, but they were sometimes up to no good, which a lot of kids are, so. I used to take it very personally when um, people didn't know where I came from or were a little bit ignorant to, you know, some of our cultural tendencies. Uh, but now I understand, like, myself, I, I, can't, I couldn't tell you a lot of uh, the way other people live their lives or their cultural um, habits. So I, I wanted to, uh, I guess my, my, my view on these things have relaxed over time and I find it more humorous than uh, 
than something I should feel um, offended by. So I welcome people, you know, we can laugh at things. Okay, so Larry is a friend of mine. Um, he is a bodybuilder and I'm really, I really wanted to uh, paint him because he's just put so much time and dedication into his craft. I guess this is more a tribute to Larry and his dedication. Thank you.